how to adjust the camera. Hello, I'm Mordecai Lacrosse. You're watching New Evolution TV. Revolutionize your life. Now, this video is about the sheriff or deputy, whatever the hell he was, in Pensacola in Florida. Um, I'll have the story in the crotch bar below. This sheriff has made claims before a murder, such as in the Billings murder, which you can actually Google that. I'll probably leave that also in the crotch bar below. But he made the claim that it was ninjas that were in the mafia. Now his recent claim, after a uh, group of people were murdered, a family was murdered with a, using a bear claw hammer or something, I believe it was called, that it was a Wiccan ritualistic blue moon killing. And the thing is, is NBC ran with this and also claimed it as well. Like I said, in the crotch part below, I have that. But the sheriff before has made false claims. Before in the past, he's made the claims that ninjas were involved in murders, uh, the mafia, this guy. Every time it comes time for a re-election for him, he makes up bullshit stories about a mur the murder that just happens to be going on at the time. But the thing is, is his recent claim of being involved, that it was Wiccan ritualistic blue moon murder, is the time that the murder took place on, it wasn't even a blue moon. The time that the bodies were found was when the blue moon. So, there right there for one, is a flaw in his claim. Another flaw in the claim that he was made is when, any, when someone actually investigates the actual thing, the murder that went on, the son, the reason why the police were sent to the family's living home situation in the first place is that the son was late to work for the Department of Homeland Security. So obviously, most likely, the real reason behind the murder, since he works for the Department of Homeland Security, is nobody likes the Department of Homeland Security, for one. For two, the Department of Homeland Security also often involves interaction with terrorists, so this could have actually been a terrorist killing of a terrorist getting back at the Department of Homeland Security and just happened to kill an agent of the Department of Homeland Security. For two or three or whatever number I'm on now, Wicca, the Wiccan read says, um, do what thy will, but harm none. I can, le I can leave some stuff in the crotch bar to below to links that point out that no real Wiccan kills at all. It's not even in the thing. Saying that Wiccan's murder is like saying that the West Bureau Baptist Church are Christians. And we all know the answer to that one. They're not. There is nothing in the religion of Wicca that at all says anything about murder. Despite what the mainstream, aka lamestream media will tell you. There is nothing in that. But I would, I would expect no less from NBC to perpetuate the, myth, the negative myths about Wicca. Because after all, they had Brian Williams, who was a well, you know on their channel for the longest time, and Brian Williams is a known fucking liar. So it's not really a shocker that NBC ran with this bullshit about Wicca being a murderous religion. Because I personally am Wiccan, and I can verify without a doubt that there's nothing in Wicca that is murderous at all. This person obviously was a sick and twisted individual and the fact that he used a hammer obviously shows that he was mentally disturbed and killed them. There was nothing ritualistic about the murder. It was just cold blood. There's nothing in the police report to indicate any new age or occult or anything of that matter involved with the murders. This sheriff was just using the situation to for his own political gain to put himself at an advantage. An embassy to run with it just shows how bigoted they are. So fuck NBC and fuck the sheriff in Pensacola, Florida. And that's all I have to say about this. Um, thanks for watching. I'm Mordecai Lacrosse. Be sure to check out the links in the crotch bar. Anyways, thanks for watching. Love, peace, and chicken grease.